This week's theme at Teach Analogy is a brisk theme weather. There's thousands of lesson plans, worksheets, and resources. Ah, but for members, there's a weather, space, volcanoes, workbook, volume one and two. There's 60 pages of activities and worksheets that are hot and cold. The other thing we have for members is a hurricane vocabulary maze. It's made with our vocabulary maze maker, which is featured this month. So become a member and storm through your monthly planning. This week, we have weather lesson plan project ideas. The first one is create a weather flipbook. And the second idea is track a storm in real time and follow it from start to finish. You can find that information right on the internet. Another thing, tip number three, is make predictions about storms and compare it to what actually happens. So have your students decide what's going to happen as the storm comes and then what did happen. Number four, make a precipitation graph for your area. Number five, make windy things, wind socks, pinwheels, weather vanes. Tip number six, check out a cloud cam live. It's fascinating. Number seven, create a weather station. The students will really love this project. Number eight, ha moods with weather, track and graph. Have students come in each day and tell you what kind of day they're having, whether it be red, kind of bad mood, green, a great mood, or blue, indifferent. And then have them keep their own graph, you make a graph in the classroom, and then track it if it changes with the type of weather outside. Number nine, get a barometer and make predictions. And finally, tip number 10, have your students decide if you should get, your school should get, a lightning rod. They will come up with some really cool ideas about why or why not. Thanks for visiting Teachnology. Keep dry and warm.